I got a Dodge, and him and his brother both were Chevy guys. One day came home with a Ford, and we were like, wow, are you kidding me? So, Kev, what do you like about this Ford over the Chevy? I really like the payload. Uh, I like the fact that it can haul 2,300 pounds. It gives me the extra edge I need with the truck camper and put the snowmobile in the back of the truck with, with all our gear, and I still get great mileage. So when are you putting the camper on? I'm really looking forward to seeing how the, the truck's going to take it. As you can see, there's a lot of suspension capacity, I guess you could say. Yeah, it'll fit right on without, without sagging. We're looking at 365 <laughs> horsepower. <laughs> when are you going to let me take this thing for a ride or what? Let's do it. So this is the big bad Ford, huh? That's right. The big good Ford. <laughs> I would never guess this is a V6. Like, if, if I didn't know, I wouldn't think this was a V6. Felt like a V8 truck, and this truck doesn't feel like you give up any power. So it felt great. It threw the back roads up the hills and plenty of passing power on the highway. So what do you think, John? Uh, would you consider one of these Fords or what? Yeah, I would. Going from a V8 to a V6 doesn't seem so, uh, so wrong right now. Best truck for your buck? With the new F-150, they really did get ahead by, you know, the great EcoBoost motor. Can get the job done, you know, with great power and great efficiency, so. F-150, it's just a good truck. It, it, it does what guys want. It's like a really good value for all the, the new technology, and I'm very happy with, with uh, you know, coming over to Ford. It's been a really good experience.